Good morning, Glads. I'm Anthony Berkey. And I'm Jada McDonald, and this is your KWHS News. College visits will resume soon, so stay tuned for more upcoming information. If you can't wait, check with the Counseling Center, your counselors, or the Counseling Center's website. It's time to find out what we're having for lunch. Ms. Bessie? Happy Wednesday, everybody. Today we're having Shepherd's Pie, so come and join us in the cafeteria. Um, we're having a meatball sub, so stop by. See you later. Bye. Thanks, Miss Betsy. That sounds great. Continuing with the food theme, Student Cabinet is hosting a fundraiser at Buffalo Wild Wings tonight. Get your yellow tickets in the main office to give to your server, so 10% of the bill can be donated to Whitefield High School's Student Cabinet. The B-Dubs is located at 2905 Geyser Drive by the World Arena. Come get your wings on. Now here's the sports team with their sports update. Good morning, Glads. I'm Dylan Hamm. And I'm Elijah Clark. And this is your Gladiator Sports Update. Winter workouts for baseball are underway in Bowers Gym. Here's your schedule. Today and tomorrow, freshmen and sophomores start at 4 p.m. And juniors and seniors, and also returning lettermen, start at 6. Girls basketball opens their season tomorrow night at Lewis Palmer. The game starts at 7. Wrestling heads to Nebraska tomorrow to take on North Platte High School. Best of luck to the wrestlers before they leave. Girls Swim has a home meet at the community center today at 4 against St. Mary's. The Gents Tourney started yesterday at lunch. Come watch more of the Gents Tourney today at lunch. It's $1 to get in and all proceeds go to student cap. I'm Dylan Hamm. And I'm Elijah Clark. Have a great Wednesday. Back to you, Anthony and Jaden. Thanks, guys. Hey, Glads, DECA is collecting pop tabs to help support the Ronald McDonald House. Your donations help ill children have a safe place to stay during medical procedures and help DECA secure a spot in National. Last year, DECA donated 17 pounds of tabs. Their goal this April is to donate 50 pounds of tabs. To beat the record, DECA needs 300 pounds. Will you help them get there? Drop off your donations in Miss Hildebrand's mailbox or in room 159. It's almost time to draw the first semester's Golden Ticket Power Prize. We sat down with Mr. Scola to find out what prizes winners might choose from this year. Here's what he had to say. Good morning, Gladiators. I just want to thank all the students who come to school every day and demonstrate power, pride, ownership, work, excellence, respect. We have a, a new incentive for you, and all of our teachers receive one of these golden tickets. All right, so just like Willy Wonka got his golden ticket, we hope you get your golden ticket. What that golden ticket will get you are a lot of different prizes. For this semester, we do have some great prizes for students, and what we will do is we will place your golden ticket in the box that you want. So for example, if you want a ski pass, we have two free ski passes to Loveland. Uh, we will put that in a box, and you will have the opportunity to win. We also have a free pair of shoes at the Runner's Roost. You get a $175 pair of shoes if you'd like. They have some pretty expensive shoes there. We also have these skateboard decks uh, for any of those students out there that like to skate. And lastly, another option for you are all these gift cards. So we'll do multiple drawings. We have a $50 movie pack, some iTunes gift cards, Buffalo Wild Wings, and Applebee's. And those range from $25 to $50. We have a great prize uh, for second semester. That's this beautiful 40-inch TV. Uh, flat screen, Samsung, great brand, great TV. This is going to be for second semester, so keep doing the right thing. Uh, we'll do the golden tickets again second semester. So again, every teacher has a golden ticket. Uh, the last day to give those golden tickets out will be uh, December 2nd, so good luck. Hopefully uh, you will get yours and you'll have the opportunity to win one of these awesome prizes. We will be doing the drawing uh, during KWHS News uh, the week following December 2nd. So thanks again for demonstrating pride, ownership, work, excellence, respect. Have a great day. If you have not dropped off your golden ticket in one of the boxes in Mr. Scollop's office, please do as soon as possible. Winners will be announced on KWHS next week. Good luck. The Security Lions Club will be selling fresh Christmas trees again this year. Trees will be sold in the parking lot of Big R. All of the proceeds go to Kids Free, which gives clothing to elementary students in Whitefield School District. Tell them you saw the email to receive a $5 discount. Gladiators, did you know that 180 Club is taking donations for their holiday food baskets? If you would like to donate, you can bring in non-perishable food items. They're also accepting cash. Last year, the club assembled 17 food baskets. Bring your donations to Mr. Sickmiller or any math teacher as soon as you can. Glads, if you are ready to get into the holiday spirit, the Community Center will be holding their 11th annual holiday tree lighting celebration 
on Tuesday, December 6th from 5.30 to 7.30. Donations of non-perishable foods, new unwrapped toys, and gently used coats will be taken. You can also enjoy crafts, story time, hay rides, s'mores, and a whole lot more. Bring your whole family. Finally, Gladstead, third yearly WHS toy drive has begun. From December 1st to December 15th, drop off new toys in the front of the Christmas tree by the main office. Help spread cheer and positivity to those in need this holiday season. That's all for today. I'm Jada McDonald. And I'm Anthony Berkey, and this was your KWHS News.